forecast to be less than ideal. We are expecting intermittent spells of heavy rain, which just might impact on the quality of the football. I don't think it's going to be sufficient to prevent the football from being played, nor indeed has it deterred the many, many fans who are in here and already generating a terrific atmosphere ahead of the game, which kicks off any moment now. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. If you're just joining us, we are already on the way. That's found its target. Going through. Danger averted for now. Gets wrestled off the ball. Up he gets! Oh, not the best of headers. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Got rid of that. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Time to deliver. It's there to get rid. And that's been levered clear. It's to clip it forward. The shot's on! Goal! There is the breakthrough! Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. Guangzhou take the early advantage. Just starting to get the first signs of rain here. Now it's Lavezzi. Here it comes. Lavezzi. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Goes for massive lead. He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Guangzhou Evergrande can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work. He's had a shot! It's a goal! And already they're looking to run away with it. Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Guangzhou take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick.
he's there to hoof it away. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be outmuscled. Now it's Lavezzi. Chance to shoot. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Just, it seems, but just is enough. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Mascherano. Out to the left it goes. He's through the middle. Now it's Lavezzi. And the flag has stayed down. The defense got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. Just brushed off the ball there. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. All the way back, and they start again. Battles to win it back. He's left his man. And that's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Lavezzi. He's made sure that that won't get through. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Taliska. Good run. Ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Done very well to intervene. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Helps available out wide. It's loose, who's getting there? No complaints about that challenge, robust but fair. Away from immediate danger. And it's been taken straight back. Oh, they've seen lots of the ball. Trying to go for it a bit. A bit of creativity and adventure. And managed to get it away. Guangzhou have it back and they can go again. And he heaves it forward. And it's hoisted clear. Really wasn't very much in that, not far away from being a telling final ball. Guanju Evergrande just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. It shoots! They are rampant! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Guanju Evergrande are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. <laughs> Guangzhou take a three-goal lead and they are rob the half-time whistle well there's plenty that can be said about the last 45 minutes but one thing that cannot be said is that it's dull one-sided yes but packed with excitement or can i simply refer you to the scoreline
Guangzhou are cruising it at half time, 3 0 ahead. And we're already back on the way here. Hebe, their manager to thank for the last result. I think, Peter, we have to give credit where it's due. He had a problem up top and he tweaked the system to sort it out. And what I like is that he doesn't hold back, he's got that who dares wins mentality and he really goes for it. Balls come loose, and the chase is on. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. And it's Lovetsi. Tries to stroke it through. Face to face with the keeper. He could be in here. <laughs> Lavetsi plays it short, crosses it in low. Hebe awarded another corner. Gets up to head it! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. A uh, good play all round. He was well hustled and, and still got a shot away. Crunching tackle. The question, that's a foul. And he's going to have his name taken. And that, I think, is his third booking altogether. I just think it was a, a cheap foul to give away. He's in! Big chance! He scored! The first touch was absolutely heavenly, and because of it, the finish was a mere formality. Hebe give themselves a fighting chance, back in with a shout. It's put paid to a promising move. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Whistle's gone and the referee has given a penalty. Guangzhou really could have done without this. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. Yeah, in truth there, it was carelessness and I think a little touch of panic, Peter, in that challenge. That usually leads to something unwanted. And that's one back! Dispatched with certainty. Well, that looked a simple case of giving the keeper the eyes and just slipping the ball to the other side. That was clever. <laughs> this is threatening to become a really good game. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming.
cut out in the nick of time. Get that clear. In comes the cross. to get it forward quickly lovely bit of skill there that's what has to be done now no question about it Jim there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this it really is a question of needs must well there's no two ways about it this is what they have to do not getting too tight which is interesting no it's probably cautionary uh, don't dive in try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind well, that's been one straight back a real chance to break he'll have a dip all the balls come loose Paulinho goes looking aimed long and direct it away. That's a throw. Hebe can make their change now with uh, a break in play. <laughs> Sticks in a foot to win it back. Receives it from behind. There's the crook. It's one! Oh, just couldn't quite turn it in. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Paulinho <laughs> puts his foot on the gas. Goes for it! Paulinho simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. And he just whacks it away. One you ever grant are looking to make this one safe they want to reduce the risk and that's not going to reach one you ever grant are clearly looking to kill this game off it's keeping the ball away from the other end too oh well intercepted really alert to the danger Lovely feet. Plenty waiting in the middle. Aimed in towards the centre. And out to safety. It's a loose ball. This is gone, that's a foul. And no surprise, that's a booking. Get the better of his opposite number. Chance to break. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Tries to dink it in. It's Lavezzi! And how good was that? 
sumptuous finish, an absolute joy. We thought it was over. It's all square once more. Smartly deceptive, what quality. It just came down to a battle of wills between him and the keeper, and he won it with a cracking piece of trickery. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. Oh, this has been an immense contribution for one player. He's been just about unplayable. The irresistible force today. So all square with almost no time remaining. Mascherano. Has he picked him out? Big chance. Got a size of goal here. Hebe merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. They are right into last chance territory. Has a swing at it! From right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Hebe are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Guangzhou take the lead. Now it's just a question of holding on. Well, the last moments now, Peter, are going to be very frantic. There's still time for a, a twist or two yet. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. And time is up. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. Guangzhou leave it late, but in the end, it was great. Well,